with every broadcast, it seems. I don't know why that happens. It really, really, really irritates me. It is so getting on my nerves. Everything can look perfect, everything can look beautiful, but I'm going to lose connection once, at least once, during my live stream. Every live stream, it seems. Well, now that I was almost finished with everything that I needed to do at the beginning of the video, I have to go and do that again. Is this? Well, it should be up and running. It looks a little weird.
Here we are. <laughs> My eyelashes are getting tangled. <laughs> anyway, hopefully we'll get most of this Hopefully we won't have any more issues. There it is. Okay. <laughs> well, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, laughing boy here, and we are going to finally get underway with Dragon Age Inquisition. I do apologize for um, all of this that's been going on. I don't know why I keep getting disconnected, but it happens every time lately. I start the uh, I start the live stream. I get everything just about set up, and I get disconnected, and I have to start over again. But then, it usually, you know, knock on wood, <laughs> it usually uh, works fine afterwards. Okay, uh, this one, uh, this save, I put about 25 hours into, <laughs> apparently. Uh, it's uh, I've been playing it a lot. I really, I really do like this game. Um, hopefully, the, the the major decision point that I'm about to, that I'm going to be making shortly is not like the major decision point and at and the end of the game. But we'll find out uh, before too long. Here we are. This is my little elf. Who am I talking to? This one. What is it? This may be worthwhile. Okay, he wants me to do this. There is a lot to this game. Uh, we'll kind of catch you up on the story as well as I can. You're in a. Um, well, kind of a Dungeons and Dragons style world, and um, there's this well, a, a big hole opened in the sky with uh, and well, a, a bunch of uh, little holes. It caused a bunch of little holes and demons are jumping out of the little holes. And um, you kind of stepped out of the big one. With, uh, and it's the, uh, the, um, I can't, I don't know if she was like the uh, high priestess or if she was like a deity. I don't, I don't really know for sure, but uh, she was behind you. I, and I don't know why these people are zipping around like that. It is weird. But anyway, so you are, you are called the Herald of Andraste, and uh, you have a mark on your hand, or character here has a mark on her hand that will, that is able to close 
the smaller rifts and as she gains uh, in the, uh, the idea is she's going around doing different things to gain um, to gain strength she's gaining influence around the world what do you want now okay I don't have all of that so leave me alone <laughs> She needs more magic uh, to make her stronger so that she can close the big rift. And, uh, well, when all of this happened, it caused a bunch of, uh, a bunch of chaos. And, um, there are, I'm getting, I'm going to get away from that waterfall. Maybe you can hear me a little bit better. There were mages, and um, there are uh, there are the two major factions are the mages and the Templars, and um, they don't really they don't like each other much. <laughs> this whole thing started when um, they were. The, uh, the 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 high priestess or whatever she was, I, I think it was the the, uh, the one that they call the most holy. So I think she was like the leader of the religion. Uh, yes, I did forget. There is a um, there is the chantry. There is uh, the the mages and there is, there are the templars. Uh, those are the three major factions and. Um, well, the leader of the Chantry, who's kind of the one over everybody, she was bringing the mages and the Templars together and trying to kind of uh, get everything, you know, everything straightened out where nobody was, was fighting anymore. But uh, the place exploded. That was where the rift opened and killed a huge amount of people. And, well... I stepped out. <laughs> Apparently what had happened is somebody came in and um, there was a person that came in, came to the, 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 the high priestess person and um, and I don't know if it was uh, trying to kill her or trying to open uh, uh, trying to open the rift or trying to bring something in I don't know what you know what was going on we'll we'll figure that out the you know, as we go along but um, <laughs> anyway so you came along the character came along and uh, come uh, came up to try to help her and so it, it it ended up with you popping out of the out, out of the the rift, not remembering anything, and uh, being hauled off. Then uh, the chantry decided the lead, the the current sort of uh, leader of the chantry decided that you were evil and needed to be hanged. Uh, but the people that were with you are with. The people that were with the character uh, and saw what the character did thought otherwise, and uh, so they just so now everything is divided. The chantry doesn't really have a a, a, a real leader. The um, the mages have went about their own business. The, I mean, everybody has they've all split up and. Um, Calm their own direction. All right, super jump backwards. Get out of the way, will you please? Yeah, kind of like um, this is kind of reminds me of uh, um, Skyrim because you can. There's a lot of places you're not supposed to go that way, but if you can, if you can 
jump in the right places, you'll make it. <laughs> so anyway, the uh, the chantry is the, the chantry. Ha they hadn't uh, last time knew. They haven't de haven't determined a new leader. They're just kind of led by this uh, this uh, clerk that wants to kill you. And um, <laughs> well, the. Uh, the people that um, were with you started what is called the Inquisition. Oh, check this out. Warlord Greatsword. Nice. I don't know what I'm going to do with it. Uh, because uh, he uses a single hand weapon. I don't... I use daggers. And they use staffs. <laughs> Reason I have it set up this way is because, um, well, I'm, my character is a is a rogue. She's kind of a fighter without the heavy armor, but um, the mages can help keep everybody alive, including each other. There's no real healers. But anyway, I hope I didn't do too bad of a job of explaining this story. The, um... So right now I'm at the point where I have to choose, um... I mean, I'm, there's still plenty of uh, let's see where am I I am I'm in the hinterland hinterland there these are all missions that I have not finished <laughs> I can show you um, completed quest uh, the hinterlands these are ones that I have finished <laughs> And, you know, and I mean, there's, I'm not saying, that's not a typical example because, uh, let's see, for example, the Storm Coast, that list is a lot shorter on, on both, where is that, and both lists, I don't know, I see the Storm Coast anyway. So, I'm going to go and pick, um, for this one I'm going to go and pick the, uh, I think I'm going to take the mage, I think I'm going to take the mages. Love waits, quest completed. You can get, uh, you do have a limit of carrying a bunch of weapons around, a bunch of, I mean, you can pick up all kinds of little trinkets, little, uh, toy soldiers and all kinds of stuff, but, which is, some stuff has uses and some stuff is just there for, just to sell. Anyway, let's, uh, I'm gonna look at the map. This is this map. You can fast travel to any of these tents. Let's see, there's something right... Right there. Flowers for Senna. Let's travel there real quick, see if we can complete this quest. 
I think we've got flowers. Now at any one of these camps, I can refill my, my potions. Well, the uh, the health potions I refilled, I uh, just I just go over there and rest, and you know, I don't know, they may refill when I walk into camp. I don't know, but <laughs> these are the things that uh, I can build for. Well, they're like basically little quests. Here I can change parties. I can change my party members. But I'm happy with the ones I have. And here I rest. It just does that. <laughs> Restores everybody's health. Well, there's a bear. There's lots of different decision points throughout the game. I'm not talking about whether or not I want to tackle that bear when there's another one right there, but <laughs> oh, never mind. I guess I don't have a choice today. You do, um, you, there, you do get to craft things uh, for yourself. Uh, for example, those blades, the blades that I crafted. What? What is that? <laughs> All left to worry about. Huh? It's dead. Whatever it is. It was a dog of some sort. Anyway, so uh, just for now. These I actually have to spend. Uh, well, I have to I have to use things to uh, refill that. Those I don't. But I just spent that just to see. Wow, there are a lot of bears out here. Coming into, into camp, putting the weapons up, did not replace my potion, but that did. Okay, so now I'm going to go over here and see, uh, and see about this mission. And I think we're going to go ahead and go to Haven and get on with the, uh, with the big one. I haven't, I haven't actually gone past there, so I, I don't really know what's um, going to happen. Return to the widow. There are, there are a lot of things in this game to do. Um, collecting shards. There are these things which are... Well, I've only done uh, one. So, I can show you one of those. There are these things. You're looking through a skull and you see these the shards, which is the thing that was lit up over here. 
I've only got, I've only collected three of the 22 that are on this map. <laughs> These are little puzzles. They're kind of, they're, they're kind of fun. Uh, let's see. This is back at the main camp, so let's go. Main, the main camp on this map. Actually, it's kind of the main camp anywhere, because, I mean, there's no other I mean there's th there's Haven and there's this place and everything else is just those little campsites <laughs> apparently I picked up the quest to go and put flowers on somebody's grave for somebody that is here in this little whatever you call it I cleaned Senna's shrine and placed the flowers. May her ashes be gathered by foul means and carried safely. After all the long years she carried me. Thank you. You do a foolish old man too much kindness. Maseranus, Dalet, take this with my gratitude. Senna would have wanted you to have it. And, um... Well, yeah, as you may have noticed, um, there was a little thing popped up down here on the left-hand side that uh, told me that um, Blackwell, which is the guy here in the armor, um, liked or disliked something. Uh, uh, what, I, what I just did, I didn't catch whether he approved or disapproved, but I'm, I'm thinking he approved, but... Anyway, so it does make a difference, and you can romance the, the, these different your different com uh, companions and two different success levels. <laughs> Let's see if one of those oculariums is close by. Uh, uh. I guess that's the only one I found, so I'm not going to be able to demonstrate. Well, maybe, maybe not. I'll go find out. I do want to demonstrate those real quick. <laughs> and then we're going to go on to the main story. They're kind of... Uh, I, I like them... They're, you know, uh, they're puzzles. Basically, you have to draw a, uh, a design using stars. And um, you can only... Well, you can only take... You can only make a, that uh, that li each line one time. You can only travel um, if you got stars A, B, and C. You can't, um, you know, you, you can travel from A to B or B to A, but you can only do that once. You can only make the line between D and A one time you can go back to I mean you can go back to B or you can go back to A or B as many times as you want to it's just so long as you don't travel that uh, that line I don't know if that if that is making sense but uh, you better figure out how to get up there. Uh, no 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 I think I've gotten up there before, but I don't remember. I don't remember how I did it. The horse can climb a little bit easier than than you can on foot. So 
something else that uh, mm, I don't think this is going to work something else that you can actually do is you can go into uh, the, the strategic mode and tell your characters to go someplace to go to you know wherever and if they can they will Oh well, let's just go over here and see if I can go up this way. Yeah, well, sometimes things are a whole lot simpler than I want to, than you want to try to make them. At least, yeah, I was making it more difficult than it was. Anyway, here we are. Now I have to make that shape, the shape that's down here down there and um, you know, I like I said I can only like if I travel if I make a line from here to here I cannot come back and make a line back to there or I do that line again so I have to uh, kind of figure out what I'm doing beforehand. And it, something that it does not tell you is you don't have to use every star that's there. Sometimes it will, it will, there was at least one where the uh, constellations, where there were two star, there were two extra stars. thinking that I'm not supposed to connect that star there. Yep. Yeah, I'm supposed to bypass that star. Pretty much the same thing. There it is. I guess that's a boat. <laughs> Once you get all three of them, it unlocks a um, that unlocks a cave that has some special items in it. Well, anyway, so... I could do that, or I could go and... Ah, hunt, yeah. I'm gonna go ahead. Let's go ahead and do that, and we'll find out what uh, special items come out of that, uh, come out of the cave, and then we're gonna go on into the uh, story. I know I keep saying that, but I'm curious. I want to know what's in. Uh, I want to know what kind of goodies I get this time. Now the, the hinterlands so far the hinterlands map is the one with the most stuff in it there are um, I mean there are other maps but they don't generally they don't have um, quite so much to do in them there's one um, desert map 
It's the uh, Forbidden Oasis or something like that. I hated that map with a passion. Because it's basically, I mean, you're trying to go from, you're trying to find all the shards and you're trying to, um, you're trying to get from point A to point B, but point A may be three floors above point B. And three levels above point B. And you can't really tell. You know, what you're looking for could be on top of the mountain or in a cave, you know, below you. So, <laughs> it gets a little irritating. <laughs> I don't think I can make... Well, maybe. No, I don't think I want to make that. <laughs> I have actually been trying to have been hopping around and trying to get to some place and then you know when I'm trying to I'm hopping up there I I happen I see one of the other characters get get around ahead of me so what I would do is I would just switch to that character here is the tactical view you can tell each character to, uh, you can tell them to move to a certain location or you can tell them to attack, but uh, I'm just going to back out of this because I think I'm, I don't think I'm going to get up there this way. Pretty sure I'm not meant to get up there this way. So, uh, all the horse. <laughs> and yes, everybody disappeared. Huh. It's funny watching them all kind of fall out of the horse. <laughs> See if I can get it. Okay. Well, they didn't do it that time. Hmm. All right. Well, oh boy. <laughs> well, I'm guessing that we're going to be starting at um, one of these ends. Uh, the thing is, I can't really tell if these two are connected. I guess they kind of have to be. Uh, let's Yeah, again, you can come back to a star. You just can't 
travel that any one of the lines the second time. And you don't have to use every star. the uh, it gives you the explanation of what each one of these things is and you do have a codex unlocked all right now we have up here just under my big fat head is where our current mission is uh, which is explore the cave which is over there. Wow. It's a good distance away and I don't see a camp that's very close. I'm going to go ahead and do that one. Now, I should have pointed out at the top of the hour that um, this game, you can pick it up. <coughs> it's pretty cheap. You can pick it up for uh, 10 to $20. I mean, uh, even, uh, I think, I think uh, it's, I think you can pick it up for about $10 used, about $20 new. And uh, although... It's out of the, out of the uh, price range for you know for Lappin' Boy plays uh, the the game of the year edition you can pick up on the PlayStation Store for forty dollars. Uh, that again that is above the thirty dollar rule, um, but it's also you know still pretty reasonable. I'm not gonna go over there. I don't want to fight. There are different perks that you can pick up along the way. Um, one of the ones that I have picked up is, um, well, basically it just makes it where it's harder for the monster, the random monsters to knock me out of the, uh, uh, off my saddle. Or, you know, well, random monsters or random uh, enemies. I think we are here. Wait, this is the apostate stronghold. I've been here already. This is, must be the wrong cave. That or there's an entrance to the right cave in here. is possible. How can you possibly dislike the Grey Wardens, Vivienne? Really? Hmm. How many people do they conscript in the name of vigilance against the blight? Hundreds? Thousands? For a threat that recent history tells us can be successfully ended by just two. Yes, they certainly are heroes, and not at all a wasteful relic of a bygone age. Whatever could I find objectionable? Say that again when a blight's at your door. The, yes, the characters, uh, your, your companions will have conversations amongst themselves. And uh, different ones interact with different ones in different ways. 
she is a mage. Uh, well, she is a mage, one of the uh, mages that are. Uh, well, I guess, what, well, she's basically she's still trying to abide by the rules. Uh, the other mage is not trying to abide by the rules. He he wasn't. Um, he was kind of. He was out on his own uh, before all of this happened. And um, my fighter here is from a group called the Grey Wardens that apparently, I do not know, unfortunately I do not really know the, the history of, uh, of this game series, but there was apparently a, you know, well, as you heard, a blight, and uh, the the Grey Wardens were the ones that got rid of it. They still exist, but they... Uh, they're kind of a, a nomadic organization, which... <laughs> I guess it's kind of an oxymoron. They're kind of a... They're... It's not common to find them and to find many of them together. But basically, I mean, they are kind of a, a protector. You know, they, they are kind of, you know, yeah, they, well, they try to protect the people. Anyway, I'm going to go to the world map. Uh, here is where we are, the hinterlands. Uh, there's the Fallowmire, which is a swamp. Uh, Storm Coast. We have uh, Valroyo, which is a city, and the Forbidden Oasis, which was that, you know, 3D puzzle I was telling you about. Ah, uh, here we go. Haven, return to the war room. Now you can. Um, there are different quests that you'll get where you can send people out on. Uh, the, the, they take it takes different amounts of time. Different things. There, there are different missions that take uh, some missions. Uh, one of my, uh, I uh, sent somebody out on took three hours, but other ones take 15 minutes. Uh, and again, it depends on, it depends on who it is you send. Also, the result depends on who it is you send you may get um, well you know the basically I guess the reward is different for each person I'll see if there's anything in there to give you an example uh, you notice yeah I did. I did mention my blades. I did create those down here in um, I'm not gonna, beside the walls. There is the um, well. There's a place where. Okay. I'm looking. I'm upside down. Outside the walls here is where. That's where the blacksmith is. You can go out there and you can create and um, enhance your weapons and armor. You will also, I mean, you also pick up different stuff uh, as you go along. You can sell most of that at different uh, merchants. And you can buy others if you so choose. You see the little, you know, the little heads here. All of these people Uh, these are different. Most of these are, are people that I can have in my party. Not all of them. Blackwell wants me wants to talk to me over there. Let's go find out what Blackwell wants. Now this map goes a little ways. And unfortunately, I cannot call my horse. You know, 
Now here's the blacksmith. I thought. Well, he said he wanted to talk to me, and I don't know where he is, though. Oh, there he is. Make a look at it. So much easier to ignore when There's it's far the, uh, away. And to actually walk out of it, to be that close. It's right there. We could take a trip if you're that curious. I'm going to have to decline. <laughs> at least until I learn more about it. I have to admit, I thought you'd be... Human. Yes. Being up front is better than knife ear. It was a foolish thought. Should have known better than to say anything. It's what you do and how you do it that's important. Just one question then. How do you think you fit in with all this? Hmm. <laughs> Each one of these will influence him, you know, his opinion of you. I just want to help stop the war. Try to put things back in order. A worthy goal, one I'm happy to support. For me, I'll be satisfied so long as Black the bastards that killed the divine. They owe us some answers. Okay, now that that's done. Yeah, I did try to alter her face. <laughs> Why she's got that giant forehead. And it, it locks up there every time. I see. You do get, uh, you do gather more people. Uh, different places you will run across different people. Uh, like um, uh, this... Um, This, this one here. I went and found her over in uh, the hinterlands. And, you know. Mother Giselle says we're losing fewer patients to fever thanks to your work. Good. The Maker is watching over us. Okay. All right. The Maker is their deity. carry on conversations as well <laughs> now here I'm just looking to see if there's any uh, any missions that, that uh, I sent people out on that have come back there does appear to be a couple of them our efforts bore fruit a portion of the profit will be passed to you use it wisely Harold okay accept the report and I can send more people out. I can send them out there to do it again. Let's see. You see, each one of them does things differently. Of course, one of them is is more about you know spying, and uh, this he's more of a general. So uh, you know he wants to do it. The military way. <laughs> uh, you know, one is um, more diplomatic. Let's see. You have the diplomat, the spy, and the soldier. And they want to handle it, and they want to handle each situation in their, in their kind of unique way. All right, so now we have a a soldier road. I can let's see. 
gathering coin if I send Josephine she says trading in favors with, with with merchants and the nobility is my specialty it could earn us a great deal if we're careful uh, Liliana said it would be a simple matter to collect secrets and sell them with nothing traceable back to the Inquisition and Cullen uh, we have soldiers, let them protect caravans and do other honest work for coin. <coughs> uh, yeah, again, soldier, thief, diplomat. <laughs> well, thief, spy, you know, she falls into the rogue category. Um... He takes 51 minutes, she takes an hour, and she takes 45 minutes. So, I'm going to go ahead and uh, I'm going to let him do it this time. Uh, this, is a, this one is repeatable. Uh, not many of them are. Okay, so I could uh, so here's the big choice. I could go over here and and side with the Templars or I could go over here and side with the mages. I this time I'm going to go and side with the mages. I have about an hour to figure out what happens after that. <laughs> All right. So here we go. We don't have the manpower to take the castle. Either we find another way in, or give up this nonsense and go and get the Templars. Redcliffe is in the hands of a magister. This cannot be allowed to stand. The letter from Alexius asked for the Herald of Andraste by name. It's an obvious trap. Let's see. I, I don't know if this is sarcasm. <laughs> Let's see. Um, we need to stop. Uh, I'm, I'm going to go with. So, we've heard from he made his move. Alexius. I expected as much. And yet, some of us want to sit and do nothing. Not this again. Redcliffe Castle is one of the most defensible fortresses in Ferelden. It has repelled thousands of assaults. If you go in there, you'll die. We'll lose the only means we have of closing these rifts. I won't allow it. And if we don't even try to meet Alexius, we lose the mages and leave a hostile foreign power on our doorstep. Even if we could assault the keep, it would be for naught. <laughs> An Orlesian Inquisition's army marching into Ferelden would provoke a war. Our hands are tied. The Magister has <clears throat> outplayed us. Let's see. We can't just give up. There has to be something we can do. We cannot accept defeat now. There must be a solution. I would like to change her street clothes. She looks like she's wearing pajamas. <laughs> uh, let's see. Let's contact the Arl. Where is the Earl of Redcliffe? I'm sure he'd help us get his castle back. After he was displaced, Earl Tegan rode straight for Dunarin to petition the Crown for help. I doubt he'll want our assistance once the Ferelden army lays siege to his castle. Wait. There is a secret passage into the castle, an escape route for the family. It's too narrow for our troops, but we could send agents through. Too risky. Those agents will be discovered well before they reach the Magister. That's why we need a distraction. Perhaps the envoy Alexius wants so badly. While they're focused on Lavella, we break the Magister's defenses. It could work, but it's a huge risk. Fortunately, you'll have help. This man says he has information about the Magister and his ah. methods, Commander. He does. <laughs> Your spies will never get past Alexius's magic without my help. So if you're going after him, 
I'm coming along. The plan puts you in the most danger. We can't in good conscience order you to do this. We can still go after the Templars if you'd rather not play the bait. It's up to you. Templars are crazy too. <laughs> All right, so um, let's see. Let's do that. Confirm. So I guess I'm taking a new mage with me. I have to take him, so I'm going to take... Um, I'm not, I'm not going to take her. I'll take... Blackwell and Vivian. Confirm. <coughs> well, I should have taken Iron Bolt. <laughs> Iron Bolt is a canary. He, he's he, he is a bolt. <laughs> well, sort of. Kind of like a minotaur. He's a, a human-ish. He's a humanoid, but he has bull horns. He doesn't have a bull's head. He just, you know, except for, you know, from here up. <laughs> Announce us. The Magister's invitation was for Mistress Lavellan and no one else. <laughs> you lot wait here. <coughs> Where I go, they go. My Lord Magister, the agents of the Inquisition have arrived. My friend, it's so good to see you I again. don't get why... And your associates, of course. I'm sure we can work out some arrangement that is equitable to all the parties. Uh, I don't get why everybody have is... no voice in deciding our fate. <laughs> Fiona, you would not have turned your followers over to my care if you did not uh. trust me with their lives. If the Grand Enchanter wants to be part of these talks, then I welcome her as a guest of the Inquisition. <coughs> Thank you. The Inquisition needs mages to close the breach, and I have them. So, <laughs> what shall you offer in exchange? Don't bother. I know that you invited me here to kill me. If you believe that, I marvel that you chose to come anyway. She knows everything, Father. Felix, what have you yeah. done? <laughs> I just want to take this uh, this uh, this time to, uh, to point out. I, I don't understand why so many people in this game are dressed like different versions of court jesters. I don't get it. <laughs> Uh, maybe you'll get to see what I'm talking about other than these two with the pointy things on I don't anyway you wanted me here why do you know what you are you walk into my stronghold with your stolen mark a gift you don't even understand <laughs> and think you're in control <laughs> You're nothing but a mistake.
do you know about the divine stair? It was the Elder One's moment, and you were unworthy even to stand in his presence. Father, listen to yourself. Do you know what you sound like? He sounds exactly like the sort of villainous cliché everyone expects us to be. Dorian, I gave you a chance to be a part of this. You turned me down. The Elder One has power you would not believe. He will raise the Imperium from its own ashes. That's who you serve? The one who killed the Divine? Is he a mage? Soon, he will become a god. He will make the world bow to mages once more. We will rule from the Boric Ocean to the Frozen Seas. You can't involve my people in this! Alexius, this is exactly what you and I talked about never wanting to happen. Why would you support this? Stop it, father. Give up the Benatori. Let the Southern Mages fight the Breach, and let's go home. No. It's the only way, Felix. He can save you. Save me? There is a way. The Elder One promised, if I undo the mistake at the Temple... I'm going to die. You need to accept that. Hmm. Seize them, Venatori. The Elder One demands this woman's life. <laughs> Your men are dead, Alexius. You are a mistake. You should never have existed. No! Okay. Not what Alexius intended. The rift must have moved us to what? The closest confluence of arcane energy. The last thing I remember, we were in the castle hall. Let's see. If we're still in the castle, it isn't. Oh, of course, it's not simply where, it's when. Alexius used the amulet as a focus. It moved us through time. What? I believe his original plan was to remove you from time completely. If that happened, you would never have been at the Temple of Sacred Ashes or mangled his Elder One's plan. I think your surprise in the Castle Hall made him reckless. He tossed us into the Rift before he was ready. I counted it. The magic went wild, and here we are. Makes sense? Mm, yeah. There were others in the hall. Could they have been drawn through the rift? I doubt it was large enough to bring the whole room through. Alexius wouldn't risk catching himself or Felix in it. They're probably still where and when we left them. In some sense, anyway. Alexius mentioned an elder one in the hall. Do you know who he was talking about? The leader of the Vestoria, I suspect. Some magister aspiring to godhood. It's the same old tune. Let's play with magic we don't understand. It will make us incredibly powerful. Evidently, it doesn't matter if you rip apart the fabric of time. <coughs> then let's go. I'm right behind you. I do want to... go over here, go to the character records, because we have a new character. And yeah, yeah. 
He has 11 points to spend, and one thing I'm going to try, I'm going to do is. I'm going to try to, I'm going to get him down to this one, and it's bonus. Okay, I'm going to apply those so that he can pick me up off the ground. Um, I'm going to spend hers. Uh, let's see. <laughs> nice. Bloody tray. Your, 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 yeah, your strikes cut deeper into any foe who's currently. Is, right. Nice. And then this one is Unforgiving Chain. Your daggers blur a dance of deadly pain. Each strike adds to your critical hit chance after a critical attack. Your chain resets it as you begin another dance. Okay. All right, here we go. I've already got the prison key. I don't know what that is. So. Wait, we're going... Okay, I can't get out this way, so I guess I'm going to have to go around. <coughs> Apparently, whatever that is, it uh, does. It's kind of got a pl uh, plumbing problem. Hello, bye bye. <laughs> Where do you go? Okay. See if we can go get uh, somebody out of somewhere. I'm thinking. Yeah, let's go down there. Lower cells. Well, okay. Andraste, have mercy. You, you shouldn't be here. 
The dead should rest in peace. Are you all right? You don't look so good. Am I dreaming? Yes. The dead asking a dead man if he's all right. You skipped over too much. Look at the poor man. Alexis' spell didn't kill us. It sent us forward in time. That's how we survived. Forward in time? I don't understand. If we get to Alexius, we can go back to the moment we left and stop all of this from happening. Maybe I've just gone mad. If what you say is mm, true... Red stuff coming out of your head. I'm, <laughs> that's possible. <laughs> Everything about this nightmare is a mistake. I should have been here, but we'll set things right. <laughs> now I know I've gone mad to set all this right. You can't imagine the things that happened after you died. The Elder One had the Orlesian Empress killed, and in the chaos that followed, his demon army invaded. The Inquisition was crushed. Anyone who refused to convert was killed. There's nothing left out there. Let's make Alexius pay for what he's done. Fine by me. <laughs> okay. And he's got his gear back. Hopefully he's not got red stuff floating around his head anymore. <laughs> okay, I'm guessing we're not going to go that way. Let's see what this is. Disciple Staff Blade. No? Okay. Well, that work. Let's go this way. Who's there? I don't know. Well, she's got red stuff floating around her. Pretend too. rescue to gain my trust. Do you think I'd fall for that? It's no trick, Vivian. It's me. I'm here to help you. You were obliterated. I was there. You can drop this pathetic ruse. No trick, I'm afraid. Alexius accidentally sent us through time. He sent you to this time? Was that meant to be a fate worse than death? <laughs> he made a mistake. We're going to correct it. Confident? We'll see how long that lasts. So, lead on. Anywhere is better than this place. Yeah, Head well, to the throne room, I kind of want uh, The guards whisper that Alexius has locked himself inside. I think I would kind of want the red smoke to stop coming out of my head, too. I need to know how much time has passed. Harvest me. 942 Dragon. 942? Then we've missed an entire year. We have to get out of here. Go back in time. Please, stop this from happening. 
Alexis serves the Elder One more powerful than the Maker. No one challenges him and lives. <laughs> That Magister's going to regret he didn't just kill me. Our only hope is to find the amulet that Alexius used to send us here. If it still exists, I can use it to reopen the rift at the exact spot we left. Maybe. Good. Hmm? I said, yeah, no, I got maybe. maybe. It might also turn us into paste. You <laughs> must That's not a good idea. Your spy master, Liliana. She is here. Find her. Quickly. Before the Elder One learns you're here. Okay. Any kind of hints as to which way I'm supposed to be going? Okay, not that way. Okay. We shouldn't keep Alexius waiting, my dears. It's dreadfully rude. Kind of goodies we got in here. Prayer stones. Don't know what that is, but okay. Hey, quit stepping on it. I want to pick. Well, never mind. I guess I picked up whatever it is I was supposed to pick up. All right, I'm in the torture chambers. Samite is, but uh the elder one is particularly hard on the charm tree. Hmm. Okay. I'm getting some good gear in here. Tell me how Lamella knew of the sacrifice at the temple. All right. to her.
You're safe now. Forget safe. If you came back from the dead, you need to do better than safe. You need to end this. Do you have weapons? Good. The Magister's probably in his chambers. You aren't She did not age here? well. No. Alexius sent us into the future. This, his victory, his elder one, it was never meant to be. I'm so sorry for everything you suffered. We have to reverse his spell. If we can get back to our present time, we can prevent this future from ever happening. And mages always wonder why people fear them. No one should have this power. It's dangerous and unpredictable. Before the breach, nothing we did. Enough. This is all pretend to you. Some future you hope will never exist. I suffered. The whole world suffered. It was real. She does not... Well, she's not we nearly were... as pleasing to the eye. I'm just asking <laughs> for information. No, you're talking to Phil Silence. Nothing happened that you want to hear. Okay, so... We need to find Alexius. I'm sure he'll be in the nicer part of the castle. There is one. That was uh, what the mark does. It closes. The, it closes the rift. But if I'm interrupted, then I have to start over, and I have to do that several times as you saw. Mm. All right, let's get on out of here, hopefully. Turn it. Well, he could be crazy. You, you, you did say it, this is madness. So. The breach hits. Wow. Everywhere. I've forgotten what the sky was like before. Huh. Interesting. I don't know why. Well, 
long while I thought it meant that uh, I was making the rift fade, but no, that's just what it's called. <laughs> Okay, so that, that part's done. Got another one over here. I got interrupted. Every time I do that, it stuns the ones that are out, but uh, it doesn't kill them. Came of Felix. Do you know? Yes. Supplies refund. Cool. And you're not going to tell me. You'll find out soon enough. Felix was uh, a son and apparently dying and was his friend. I mean, the son of the guy that did all this. Kill so many of them before it will uh, solidify. Split. <laughs> solidify. Uh, this one's almost done, so we just had to kill up the rest of them and then. There's something wrong with your voice there. Uh, yeah, the red smoke. <laughs> red smoke coming from your head. That's what's wrong with the Where voice. Where did Alexius find this? How did he even move it here? Can we open it? Perhaps. But it looks quite strong. How desperate and paranoid must he be? His servants must have a way through. He has to eat. Let's look around. on Draste's name is that? Hold on to it. I want to look at it later. Okay, well, uh... Hmm. Oh, 
damage did Alexis' spell do? Rift tore apart all of Southern Thedas, starting here. But whether that's his doing or the breach, who can say? So apparently there is more to this story after this, because I'm getting schematics to go build stuff. That's basically the character sonar. You just push down the L3 and it does that. Highlights enemies in different uh, you know, collectible stuff. It's within your range. Also, if you're, you know, like if you're, if you have a mission objective that is, you know, go find so and so. If you get close and you use that, it will tell you that you're close in what direction. Okay. Come here. And this is what you're supposed to do. No, that's not what you're supposed to do. You're just supposed to push the X button. I think I'm gonna have to have a have a little fight here. Well, maybe not. Okay. That's weird. Just a little lost. Try to take out that enchanter quickly. Enemy! All off the stairs! Mm. That didn't work right. One thing about this game that, that I like is the fact that um, you can go and change. You can go and change the difficulty level pretty much any time. Ah. until I get finished with this. I should have started it earlier. <laughs> hmm. 
But I really do, I mean, this, there is a lot to this game, and I do recommend it. If you haven't played it and you enjoy this kind of game, I definitely do recommend this, this one to you. Ah. Come on, slow catch up. today I you know which is good being that I started late well and it's uh, good because I'm lost Full. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to go into my inventory. Uh, let's see, go to valuables. Here we have one of those toy soldiers. Yes, I'm going to throw that away. A nug totem. I have no idea what that is. A nug is a little rabbit pig thing that's running around there. Uh, it's mm. Well, let's see. Generally, this final entry, nothing works. I've tried countless times to go back before the conclave, conclave explosion, before Felix's caravan was attacked by Darkspawn, before the Ven Venatori first arrived in <coughs> Minrathus. Without success, the breach is the wellspring that makes this magic possible and travel outside of its timeline is impossible. The Elder Ones demand that I change the events of the Conclave can never be fulfilled. He may kill me for failing him, but I must protect Felix from his wrath. Hmm. Even in his craziness, he cares for his son. I don't want to extra Okay, no. Got to go back in there. And figure out how to get to this floor somewhere.
Okay, I'm... Okay. A room full of red stuff, and then I. Oh, come on. I'm getting steered away from it. Get to it. I can do that. No, oh, not him. Him. Now you just be so kind as you get out of my way. What the... <laughs> They're right there. You should try to... Okay, it looks like I'm after these shards. I've got four of the five. to remember next time to use some of my potions before I replenish them. <laughs> Oversized creepy lava lamp in the floor in the middle of the room. Everybody stand in the door. <laughs>
They're distracted. Worshipping their own world. Take them down before they see you. Even though I'm a thief, <laughs> not generally the way I thought. Okay, now let's uh, yeah, let's do that. I want to get back. I want to get out of here before I end this live stream. Show you guys the ending of this part of the game, anyway. Alexius, all this suffering, and for what? For my country, for my son. But it means nothing now. I knew you would appear again, not that it would be now, but I knew I hadn't destroyed you. My final failure. <clears throat> Was it worth it? Everything you did to the world, to yourself, it doesn't matter now. All we can do is wait for the end. It does matter. I will undo this. How many times have I tried? The past cannot be undone. All that I fought for, all that I betrayed, what have I wrought? Ruin and death, there is nothing else. The Elder One comes for me, for you, for us all. <laughs> so, that's Felix. Make his breath, Alexius. What have you done? He would have died, Dorian. I saved him. Please, don't hurt my son. I'll do anything you ask. Hand over the amulet and we let him go. Let him go and I swear you'll get what you want. I want the world back. <laughs> Wait, you quit popping around. <laughs>
wanted to die, didn't he? All those lies he told himself, the justifications. He lost Felix long ago. <laughs> didn't even notice. I know you cared for him. Once he was a man to whom I compared all others. Sad, isn't it? This is the same amulet he used before. I think it's the same one we made in Minratus. That's really. Give me an hour to work out the spell he used, and I should be able to reopen the rift. An hour? Hmm. That's impossible! You must go now! There's a reason they won. We'll go on ahead. Take out as many as we can. Liliana, you're the last line of defense. Give them what you've got. No, I won't let you commit suicide. Look at us. We're already dead. The only way we live is if this day never comes. Makes Just sense. Go. You have as much time as I have hours. That was fun. Though darkness closes, I am shielded by flame. Andraste, guide me. Maker, take me to your side. You move, and we all die! Jack him up, girl. Jack him up. <laughs> Extending this charade, Felix. It's going to be all right, Father. Mm -hmm. You'll die. Everyone dies. That's over with. Or not. Grand Enchanter, we'd like to discuss your abuse of our hospitality. Your Majesties, when we offered the Major Sanctuary, we did not give them the right to drive our people from their homes. King Alistair, Queen Anora, I assure you, we never intended. In light of your actions, good intentions are no longer enough. You and your followers have worn out your welcome. Leave Ferelden, or we'll be forced to make you leave. But we have hundreds who need protection. Where will we go? Let's see. You'll be leaving here with the Inquisition. And what are the terms of this arrangement? Hopefully better than what Alexius gave you. The Inquisition is better than that, yes? We need their skills, but they have proven themselves far from trustworthy. No one fights well for their captors. It seems we have little choice but to accept whatever you offer. Uh. 
I, uh, yeah, let's see. Well, if I take them as allies, then some will like it and some won't. If I take them as prisoners again, some will like it and some won't. But uh, I'm going to take them as allies. We would be honored to have you fight as allies as Solus the greatly side. approves. A generous offer. But will the rest of the Inquisition honor it? The breach threatens all of Thedas. We cannot afford to be divided now. We can't fight it without you. Any chance of success requires your full support. It's a generous offer. I Cassandra greatly disapproves. Iron Bull disapproves. <laughs> We accept. It would be madness not to. I will gather my people and ready them for the journey to Haven. The breach will be closed. You will not regret giving us this chance. Well, so now I have the mages on my side, and uh, well, of course, the Templars are not ever going to talk to me, I guess, uh, <laughs> and uh, some of my people are mad at me, some of my people are really happy with me, and uh, well, that's the end of my live stream. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I thank you so much for watching. Please remember to come back Thursday for my uh, Grand Theft Auto 5. There will be abominations oh. among the mages, and we must be prepared. If we rescind the offer of an alliance, it makes the Inquisition appear incompetent at best, a tyrannical at worst. What were you thinking, turning mages loose with no oversight? The veil is torn open. Okay. Um, again... Please be sure and check the link below for the uh, my my upcoming video game series. And uh, if you haven't already, go there and and uh, vote on your choices on what I'm going to be doing while I'm playing Fallout 4. But be sure and come back Thursday and check out uh, Grand Theft Auto 5 Story Mode. I'm coming to an end. I don't know when it's going to be, but it's probably going to be over the next uh, over the next few weeks the next probably uh, couple of weeks anyway <laughs> thanks for watching have a wonderful day laughing boy out